days and I'm gonna be doing a crystal haul so <laughs> well I've had these crystals for quite some time but I keep buying more and I'm supposed to be saving for a nice DSLR camera but if you're obsessed with crystals as much as I am, then you'll understand. Get right started. Let's, whoa, <laughs> let's get started with this haul. So the first crystal I have is Celestite. This crystal is used to connect to the angelic realm. It connects to the third eye chakra, throat and the crown chakra. It helps with angelic communication. It's a beautiful light blue color. I do have a bigger piece of it. This is just a smaller piece because I wanted a smaller piece. Absolutely beautiful. Next up I have is citrine. I also have a bigger piece of this. This is a citrine point. Citrine is heated amethyst. Man-made. I think it's man-made. Um, I'm not quite sure. <laughs> but... I know it's heated amethyst. Citrine helps to bring in joy. It works with the solar plexus. It generates prosperity and success, abundance, and it helps magnifying personal power. And I l absolutely love citrine because I am definitely trying to work with my solar plexus more, and this is just perfect. So. If you're trying to grow a business, trying to gain more money, like more abundance, um, trying to be more self-empowered, citrine is for you. The next up, I have a clear quartz egg. I actually have more clear quartz um, sitting on my altar over here. Um, yeah, this is beautiful. Clear quartz is known as the anything stone. It helps to balance all seven chakras. It radiates every color of the light spectrum that's how it heals the chakras it'll generate that energy and it helps to clear your mind clear anything negative away and it helps to charge like other crystals charge positive thoughts it's just a great stone and it also helps to balance the immune system so if you're having immune problems <laughs> And get clear quartz. <laughs> Next up, I have amethyst. I have an amethyst egg. And then I have an amethyst point. I have a bunch of more amethyst. And I actually have some coming in the mail. I have an aura amethyst coming in the mail. It's like titanium covered. It's beautiful. I'll probably do a video on that, just on that by itself when I start working with it. But. Um, yeah, oh, yep. these are all crystals that I've been working with throughout the year, and these are my favorite crystals that I'm showing you guys. Oh, yeah. Amethyst, this is a beautiful purple stone, helps to guard negative thoughts, psychic attack, um, it works with the crown and third eye chakra, so these two. <laughs> It helps to balance, open them up. I actually had an experience with my other amethyst point, this one. This one I am very, very connected to. Um, whenever I place it on my third eye, it it burns, like it hurts really bad. Um, these two points are different sizes, if you can't tell. <laughs> um, yeah, but it's great. To go to sleep with because it prevents insomnia it's a very relaxing stone to hold um if you're just starting out with crystals i definitely definitely recommend getting amethyst or rose quartz i've had amethyst literally no joke since i was like five years old i have a piece like the size of my hand that I've had since I was a child and I used to work with that crystal all the time but not knowing what I was doing but I was also very intuitive as a child and that just helped to enhance everything it helps to bring wisdom it's just good so yeah if you're a very anxious person carry a piece of amethyst it will calm you down next up have is Peridot. Peridot. This is a stone used to help 
the life cycle. It helps to dispose and get rid of any negative habits and replacing them with positive habits. It connects the heart chakra and the solar plexus. If you place it on there, it'll help to clear and balance those chakras. And it definitely helped communicate with the unicorns and like that side, but I could do, I'm definitely going to do another video on like metaphysical creatures and mythical things because I know quite a bit. Um, but yeah, this definitely helps with having a drug problem or like some just bad habits like you're mean to people. This will help this little itty bitty baby. Um, I actually got this for free when I got this piece of aqua aura quartz. She, the seller just threw this in for free, which was really nice of her, and I'm super grateful that she did that because I had wanted a piece of peridot for a long time, but they're so hard to find and they are so expensive. So, and yes, I've looked on eBay, Amazon, um, Crystal Age, which is where a majority of my crystals are from, like all of my amethysts except for that one are from the Crystal Age, so I will link that store down below. I'm not sponsored, I wish I was, I would be so grateful, but I will link that store down below. It's a UK based store, but it's definitely very legit. Um, this is from the Geo Fossil, I think, on eBay. And the ones that I showed before are from the Crystal Age, but yeah, Peridot, perfect. Um, <laughs> I have aqua aura quartz. Oh shit. <laughs> I have this aqua aura Herkimer diamond. And then I have this aqua aura point. Aqua aura is a very flashy, beautiful stone. It helps to enhance communication of all kinds psychic, physical, whatever. Um, it helps to enhance success, wealth. Um, if you know the power of Aqua Aura Quartz, it can make you a billionaire from what I've read and what I've heard. So, and I am absolutely obsessed with these. Like, I love Aqua Aura Quartz. It is probably one of my favorite crystals. I will definitely show you my favorite crystal, though, after these guys. Um, yeah. Well, these are all my favorite, but like my specific favorites, like if you were to ask me to choose one crystal that was my absolute favorite, it would be the Aqua Aura Quartz because it it works for your throat chakra, so I'm definitely feeling very chit-chatty, but yeah, it's great. So if you're having communication problems, like with anyone, or like you're a very shy person, like I'm a very introverted, shy person, and having aqua aura helps me so much. I do carry it with me sometimes, but I don't want to lose it, so yeah. Next up, I have angel aura. This is treated with platinum, and when used in meditation, it can help someone find their soul's purpose, and yeah, can help with angelic communication just like this. I like having angelic stone because I definitely like to work with angels sometimes, but I mean, yeah, I mainly work with a different type of being. It's not a negative though. I just can't share it. I'm not allowed to. <laughs> Gotta keep that. Sacred. But yeah, then I have pink aura. This is a Lumerian raspberry starberry rose aqua aura. Not aqua aura, it's pink. What am I saying? It is pink aura, or known as rose aura. It is created the same way as the angel aura. This is my favorite stone. This is beautiful. I love I pink. I'm obsessed with pink. Um, but yeah, it is made with platinum, like platinum powder, and a bunch of different metals, like mixed together. They Nobody knows where this color comes from, but it is beautiful. And it is used to heal, and the frequency of this beauty is used to help 
physical pain and emotional pain what this stone does is it'll go in on a cellular spiritual level and heal you but it'll also match your frequency to how much healing you need so it's very adjustable it's like a seat belt almost and I love it <laughs> the next step I have opal I have this piece of fire opal right here and then I have tumbled or polished opal opal promotes a sense of calmness and security like if you can't tell I just got really cool. decrease stress and depression and opal is the scent opal helps to center the mind and it helps to bring joy and happiness into your life so if you are feeling depressed ungrounded get opal <laughs> then I have red jasper which I did show in another haul so if you haven't seen that haul yet I will link that down below this stone is a beautiful beautiful red well this is maroon <laughs> um it helps to balance the root chakra and it helps to ground that chakra to mother Gaia so if you aren't feeling grounded Jasper will be your best friend I know it's mine <laughs> and then lastly I have is serpentine serpentine gets its name from snakes because it's coloring Well, I'll, sh I'll show close shots of it, but it looks like a snake. Um, it's also known as New Jade. It helps to balance mood swings. If you can't tell, it just helps to balance me. <laughs> um, and it helps to solve conflict. So if you're having a conflict and you're holding a piece of serpentine, it'll help you come to come up with like different ways to solve it. So, yeah, and it also helps to awaken Kuno. Yeah, that is my crystal haul, but I just want you guys to know that crystals aren't meant to, like, or give you what you want. They're here as a reminder to be more positive and of that goal you have. They're here to give you that energy in order to gain that success and gain the momentum you need. So let's say your work, you're trying to find love then you get a piece of rose quartz and it'll give you that energy to attract that love. It's not going to give you that love. Um, or like citrine, it promotes success. It gives you the energy to gain the momentum to become successful and be more self-empowered. Just remember that when you get a crystal. And they're also pretty to look at, so <laughs> yeah. I hope you are having a nice day. Please subscribe if you haven't yet. I would really be so appreciative, so grateful if you did that. Um, but yeah, you can find me on Instagram and Twitter. I hope you have a wonderful day. And I will see you next time. So, bye. Thanks for watching. Um, you can just like mix the colors, you can use water, you can do it without like a ton of water on the paper. Like it is so much fun. I do have a store where I sell original artwork, like watercolor paintings and like drawings and stuff. So I will link that down below and you can go check it out. So yeah, first paint I have is this Windsor Newton Professional Water.